we'll be reviewing a topic in this video titled, Causes of Power Clogged Catalytic Converter. Hey there! Welcome to my channel. I appreciate you, all my viewers. Please, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. You might be asking how a clogged catalytic converter causes loss of power will? Or can a bad catalytic converter cause a car to shut off? If you desire a response to these questions, this video is for you. I will also discuss how a bad catalytic converter can cause a car to shut off and how to start a car with a clogged catalytic converter. You need to know that whenever your engine runs rich, the cat converter will work harder and run hotter than normal. The heat can also damage the substrate, which causes it to degrade and melt, resulting in excessive back pressure. When this happens, it can become loose. The loss of power and acceleration is caused by a clogged catalytic converter that blocks the exhaust flow. This means that when the restriction is severe, the vehicle engine may not run. If you have ever wondered if a clogged catalytic converter could cause a loss of power, then in this video, I will provide you with the answers. A clogged catalytic converter can cause a loss of power. A clogged catalytic converter causes a car's loss of power and acceleration due to the blockage of the exhaust flow blocks. Whenever the engine runs a rich air and fuel mixture, more unburnt fuel will go to the catalytic converter as part of the exhaust gases. This means that when the restriction is severe, the vehicle engine may not run. So, how will a clogged catalytic converter cause loss of power? Loss of power during acceleration and misfiring is a sign that your catalytic converter is clogged. Whenever the catalytic converter is clogged, there will be back pressure in the exhaust manifold. This will happen because all pistons are connected via the same crankshaft, which means when one piston slows down, it will slow all others. Then you'll observe that you must press the accelerator pedal harder than normal. Nevertheless, another way that a clogged cat converter can cause loss of power is when exhaust gas leaks back into the cylinder due to the exhaust manifold's excessive back pressure. To confirm an exhaust restriction, you can use a vacuum gauge. Once the needle on the gauge drops slowly to 10 hg while you increase the engine speed to about 2500 rpm, examine the exhaust for a clogged cat converter. Will a clogged catalytic converter cause a car not to start? Firstly, you must note that a cat converter is a passive device that your car's exhaust gases pass through. However, the only thing that could affect the manner of performance of your car is that it would somehow get plugged up. However, this might likely not happen. Now, can a bad catalytic converter cause a car to shut off? Also, note that a bad catalytic converter won't cause your car to shut off. This is because the catalytic converter is in an ignition system, which means it doesn't have any functionality that could stop a combustion engine from functioning. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Here is what to do if a clogged catalytic converter causes a loss of power on the car. As you know, the mixture of air and fuel to get combustion is what a vehicle's engine uses to produce power. So the energy produced as a result of the combustion will be distributed to the wheels, and the car moves. But note that the engine must perform this with maximum efficiency. The engine loses power, and you will experience a loss of in-car performance. So if a clogged catalytic converter causes a loss of power in the car, a cleaning solution can be used to get rid of all the debris that has accumulated inside the engine system. How do you fix a clogged catalytic converter caused by loss of power? The only way to fix a clogged cat converter is to clean it up, and there are two ways this can be done. The first way is to simply clean it with a pressure washer or leave the converter overnight inside a hot water solution of dish soap or degreaser. You also need to note that soaking it overnight can be a better option as it takes off any chances of causing damage to the internal mesh of the converter. The second fix is called the Italian tune-up by lots of people. The cat converter will clean up itself whenever the engine is functioning well, and the catalytic converter can get to the proper working temperature. This is what the Italian tune-up is all about. It pushes your vehicle to the point when the cat converter heats up very well to burn the soot. However, this can be done in two ways. One of them is by accelerating hard on an empty road, and the other is by trying to sustain the vehicle's top speed over a few miles or whenever it is parked reviving the engine to about 70 to 80 percent of its rpm range and allowing it to remain like that for some minutes please note that both ways are potential methods to clean smaller buildups of soot except mash isn't damaged how do you start a car with a clogged catalytic converter the vehicle cat converter can get so clogged that it can freeze the engine completely and prevent it from starting or igniting so once this happens to you 
then it is vital that you know how to remedy the situation as soon as possible. This means you can either clean up the cat converter, totally replace it, or take your vehicle to a mechanic so that it can be handled for you. To start a car with a clogged catalytic converter here's a quick fix, pull the O2 sensor. In case you want to get your vehicle up and running as soon as possible, the fastest fix is to take off the front oxygen sensor from the vehicle. However, the result would be that the exhaust will be thunderous, and that's when it's idle. This will even get louder when you start accelerating. So you must operate your car with all your windows entirely down. This is to prevent any carbon monoxide, toxins, or harmful gases that the catalytic converter would have stopped from coming into the cab of your vehicle and causing you health issues. In conclusion, as said earlier, a cat converter is an emissions control device that turns toxic exhaust gas into less harmful substances. Cat converters are vital components of a car. So whenever the cat converter gets clogged up and fails, it can lead to emission issues and potential safety hazards, especially to the public. However, like other components, catalytic converters are prone to breaking down due to heat up and could be damaged by dirt. So when this happens, then cleaning it up or replacing it completely would be the possible solution. If I should ask you, will a clogged catalytic converter cause loss of power? I am sure you know the answer already. So far, from what I've explained in this video, it can be deduced that a bad catalytic converter can cause a car to shut off, and yes, a clogged catalytic converter can cause a car not to start. I have also explained how to fix a clogged catalytic converter caused by a loss of power. I hope you find this video to be informative. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just click the subscribe button.